and good day. I'm Dan Andre, and this is my studio. Uh, today, I want to talk about drumsticks and picking a good one that fits your style. Um, you know, how, how do we pick one? What do we know? You know, is, do we want longer sticks? Do we want shorter sticks? Do we want thinner sticks? Do we want thicker sticks? These are all great questions when it comes to picking drumsticks. For me, I've tried a bunch over the years. I still experiment to this day. Actually, I have two here that we're going to talk about that I experimented for the last week with. Um, but I'm going to start with the LA-5A model, the Los Angeles 5A. This is a great stick. The reason why I want to start with this one is because for anybody who's not sure where to start, or even for teachers who want to recommend a good stick for a beginner, this is the one. Um, the reason why I say that is, is it's a 5A, which is a standard stick size. It's got a pretty normal length, normal diameter, so it's not too thick. It's not too long, it's not too short, it's right there, it's a good balance between all the, up, all the long and short and all that stuff. It's right in the middle. This is, a group, this is a good one. Actually, every student that comes in, I give them a, a brand new pair of sticks and this is what I give them. So they have a reference point and a starting point for what to get. These sticks, I gotta say, Vader drumsticks are the most durable drumsticks that I've ever used. And um, for the drummers who know me, know that I can hit pretty hard and these sticks will take it. So here's one of my older ones, pretty beat up, as you can see, but you know, it takes it. And I use all of the stick. I use the back, I use the middle, I use the shoulder, I use the tip. You now you can get the rim shots. So you're getting both of this here, you use your cross stick and you're getting back here. And this stick, man, it really can take it. So again, beginners, this is the stick I like to give out. And it's not a beginner drumstick, it's just a good size for beginners. And as you experiment and you get, you know, bigger in drumsticks or longer in drumsticks, you find out what you like. For me personally, I use a lot of finger technique in my playing, whether it's really small or really big. I use a lot of it. I use everything, wrist, any arm, but mostly I use a lot of fingers. So this is a good one. Next up, I want to talk about warming up. This warm up's a big part of what every drummer does. I personally like to use a bigger drumstick when I'm warming up. So, and some of the drumsticks out there that people like the Core Master drumsticks and some of those like snare drumsticks are really big. And I like to use something in between those, which is the MV11, which is a marching stick for junior high school. So middle school, seventh, eighth grade, ninth grade kids. But I personally like the stick because it feels like a marching stick, so it's a little bigger. It's got a good length, again, it's a length I like. It's got a, a bigger tip on it, a little rounder, bigger tip, which is nice for rebound and stuff to get that big tip, it comes back. You can also use my finger technique stuff with this stick. It's very solid, you can feel it, you can hear it too in the pitch. Um, this is a great stick. You buy a pair of these for warming up, you're gonna have them for a very long time. So I, I like to use these. Good stick, love them. Next, we're gonna come up to my experimentation sticks, okay? Um, and the first one I experimented with was the Extreme Design XD5A. So this is like the LA5A, except it's just a tiny bit longer. Me personally, I like a longer reaching stick so I can choke up or I can choke down. So I do that a lot. I move around the stick a lot, constantly adjusting and moving. Um, you know, if I'm playing quieter, I'm going to move up. I can move back to to get a little bit more, you know, control from the back end of the stick. These are great. If you want to experiment with a longer stick, this is what I suggest. The XD5A. This is a good one. Gives you a little bit extra reach. Same size as a 5A as far as thickness goes. Great rebound. Great stick. Last up, this one I needed to get because I couldn't find him in stores and I was reading about him in the catalog and he's one of my favorite players and that's the, the Virgil Donati Assault Stick. Now what drew me to this stick was not only Virgil Donati's amazing playing but was the fact that it has the same girth as my warm-up sticks which is the marching stick, the MV11 and it's got a slightly smaller tip than that one too. It's got a smaller shoulder you can see the taper is real short here. It's a shorter taper. 
got a nice big shoulder there. Okay, and it's a, it's a pretty, pretty thick set. And for me, it's right in between the 5A and the marching stick. So this is a nice stick for me. Um, again, it's got that little extra reach on it. So I can slide up or down, you know. Durability, amazing. It's a hickory stick, it's real hard. Um, this is a stick that I would choose for myself if I was playing like an outdoor venue or a bigger indoor venue where I want to get a little bit extra cut through the drums. It's a little bit bigger, so I don't have to work as hard when I'm hitting the drums. I shouldn't be working hard anyways, but the smaller sticks, the thinner sticks, you know, they're, they're more suitable for the choirs, quieter venues, like small places and clubs. Um, for that, I would suggest the Manhattan Jazz Stick. That's a great drum stick. That's a good one for little kids, like, you know, five, six, seven years old. They have small hands, you give them a really small stick. Uh, but me personally, I, I like a little bit of a beefier stick. So, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope, you know, this helps you with picking drumsticks. Um, I always pick Vader. They're great. They care about education, which is really important to me, making sure that we're pushing music in the right direction. So go out, you know, to the local store. Find a pair. You know, you'll find LA 5A sticks almost everywhere. Grab a pair of those. Grab a pair of all these, you know, and just try them out because the only way you're going to learn about which sticks work for you, which ones are better, which ones are worse, is by trying. Um, I didn't know I was going to like these Virgil Donati drumsticks, and actually these are like my favorite drumsticks now. Love these things. But, you know, I love all of these drumsticks, but these, these are like my new favorite pair now. So have fun, experiment all you can, have you know, a ton of, ton of fun doing this, and if you have any questions or you have a favorite pair that you like, put it in the comment below and uh, you know, have fun.